I'm here with Dr. Joyner and Dr. Hardaway. They're just finishing up Maggie's spay. Uh, spay is really important for us. We don't want to contribute to the captive bear world by introducing more cubs, having more cubs born at our facility. So all of our bears are sterilized at the sanctuary and uh, we like to keep it that way. So having Maggie tranquilized is a really great opportunity to get in here and look at their teeth, give them a really good once over, do some blood work. But bears, you know, they have a sweet tooth just like we do. So it's very important to check their teeth regularly because they, one of their biggest problems is they get cavities that turn into abscesses and uh, we don't want that. So it's a good opportunity to look at the teeth, see if there's any problem spots and uh, take care of them now while we have the chance. We got Jake tranquilized. This might be the only opportunity we get to weigh him. So we're getting him on the scale here. Get a kind of a rough estimate of what he weighs. Uh, he's about 322, what's on the scale, but he's got four legs off and this head right here probably weighs 15 pounds. So we're guessing he's 350, a little, maybe a little bit more. Jake is a Hulk. So now we're getting him up on the table. We're gonna opt to give him a vasectomy. And uh, you know, I'm gonna measure his canine here and he's already at three years old, has an inch and a half canine. He's gonna be a big bear. Well, we're gonna do a vasectomy on this guy. And um, so we're just clipping and prepping this pre-scrotal area here. We're gonna make, make an incision right along in here. We're gonna dissect down to each of the vascular bundles uh, to the testicles and uh, identify the vas and do a, do a vasectomy. And that's gonna render him sterile, yet he'll still retain all of his male hormonal influence and therefore he'll grow and look and act like a full-fledged male bear which is important to what these guys would like to see and now we gotta give him the trailer and get him back home quick before he wakes up he's a heavy boy jake at three years old has an enormous paw i mean this is actually the average size of an adult Yellowstone grizzly male's paw right here. So at three years old, he's already that big. Yeah, he's a big